Senator Marco Rubio is calling for a revamping of the U.S. economy so that it better serves the American people. The Florida Republican at the Catholic University of America this morning said that common good capitalism can restore dignity for many who are left behind. Our challenge is an economic order that is bad for our country, for our society, for our people. It's bad economically because it's leaving too many people behind. It's bad because it's inflicting tremendous damage on our families, our communities, and our society. Common good capitalism is about a vibrant and growing free market. But it is also about harnessing and channeling that growth to the benefit of our country, of our people, and our society at large. The national correspondent for the Tablet and Crux, Christopher White, was at the Catholic University in Washington when Senator Rubio spoke. He joins us now on the phone. Christopher, thank you so much for joining us. Good to be with you, Tamara. Christopher, how much did the senator draw from Catholic social teachings and the writings of recent popes for his speech? Tamara, this morning the senator spoke, uh, you know, recalling uh, words from the three most recent popes, uh, John Paul II, Benedict XVI, and Francis. Uh, however, I, I think, you know, his, his broader message was that of a, a, a sort of an assessment of the current state of the economy and what it means for families. Uh, it wasn't uh, exactly a theological reflection on some of the core principles of Catholic social thought, such as solidarity, subsidiarity, human dignity, but rather a current state of affairs. Did the senator talk about his own faith at all? He did. He, he spoke in personal terms talking about his own parish in Florida, you know, talking about the service that they provide to the community. Uh, but again, it was, uh, you know, talking about it more in a practical reflection rather than that of a, a broader theological treatise, which is what some thought that the day was great. Christopher White, the national correspondent for The Tablet and Crux, thanks so much for being with us today. Thank you, Tamara. Good to be with you. If you're watching Currents News on YouTube, be sure to hit the subscribe button and then click on the bell to get instant updates about all of our newest content because we are putting your faith in the news.